Hey team, we're gonna review our one, two, two defense. Here's the setup. We've got our point guard above the three uh, point key, the arc. We've got our three and our two man, either side of the high post. And then we've got our five and our four on the block. So one, two, two, that's our setup. The goal is to entice the offensive player to either dribble to one side, pass to one side, in which we will initiate a trap. In this example, we'll see that the one passes the two. Our one and two will then trap. Let's watch the action. Once that trap occurs, we're gonna see rotations. We're gonna see our three men replace our one here to watch their one man. We're gonna see our five go to the middle of the key here to watch the five man here. And we're gonna have our four man creep in a little bit to watch the four, their offensive four. So let's watch the rotations. reason why we're rotating this way because now we've got this whole side here for our ability to get a steal our four man we don't need to deny right away because we want to entice the two offensive player to throw it to the four in which we'll initiate another trap in which we'll almost guarantee our steal because we'll have them trap over here on the baseline and it's almost virtually impossible for a third grader at this time to throw a cross court pass all the way to the three. Let's watch the action. Trap. Here we go. So here are all our steal opportunities. So we've got a trap here. It's important here for our one man to deny because we don't want this pass coming back here. We don't want to bail him out. We want the pass going either to their four, to their five man, to their one, or to the cross court, because we'll have the five, our five, and our three men waiting to get a steal. That's it. Thanks, guys.